points, I have T. These are the tension. Of course, I can draw, and in other problem of pulley, and I give you as homework, you will need. Here is tension T2, and here T2. نقاط التقاء الحبل هذا ب سواء كان بالبقره او بالاجسام بنحدد عند كل نقطه التقاء كم مقدار الشد ما انا عندي حبل واحد اذا نقطه الشد عندي في هذا الحبل يساوي ثابته قيمه ثابته نيكست نيكست ستيب از تو استابليش ان ويتش بارت از موفينغ ذا سيستم بات يو سي I give you only theoretical mass, M1, M2. I didn't give you not relation between masses, no numbers. So how is the system moving? The answer is, I don't know. So what I do if I don't know? I suppose. Let's say this one, how do you want? Up or down? سنفترض في هذه الحالة أن الجسم يتحرك إلى الأعلى أو الأسفل مثلاً. I don't know. No, I didn't write. Here is comma. I don't know. Do you want up? Yes. Let's suppose that this one is moving with the acceleration a. That means this one will go down with the acceleration a. Yes. That I suppose. And if I am wrong, no problem. When I'll do numerical result, there are two possibilities. To have plus, that means the acceleration are as I choose, or to have minus, that means the acceleration are opposite as I choose. You understand? Okay. وبقول ايش انه اذا نبدا بافتراض احنا ممكن نفترض انه الجسم مثلا ام 1 يتحرك الى الاعلى وهذا افتراض قد يكون صحيح قد يكون خاطئ لكن آه مش مشكله سواء افترضنا الى الاعلى او الى الاسفل سيان يعني الامر فكل ما هنالك انه النتيجه النهائيه اذا اتفقت مع الفرض تبعي بكون فرضي صحيح اذا اختلفت بكون فقط الاتجاه في الحركه هو اللي اختلف. The second step is to choose isolate system. Isolate system means a system with mass and all the force which are connected to them. Here is one of system. And here is the second system. Now I can read. The second law of dynamics, mass of in the simple form, mass of acceleration equal force. Yes. So here I have mass of acceleration m one a equal forces T plus m one g minus. Okay. For the other one, please tell you. You tell me, but not you tell all, because you have seen this. Tell you for the other. Okay, minus m two a equal t minus m two g. Okay, t minus m two g. Okay. Then. كتبنا المعادلات معادلة قانون نيوتن الثاني على الجسم الجسم الأول والجسم الثاني m واحد في a في تسارع تساوي مجموع القوى t الشد ناقص m one g والجسم الثاني ناقص m two ليش لأنه عندي للأسفل يساوي t للأعلى ناقص m two g till here it's the idea from the first problem فعنا الآن مجهولين مع معادلتين مجهولين. Is the moment when I number the equation two, yes, and I number the unknown, acceleration and tension. Two unknown 
two equations can be solved, okay? Only for this I solve. For the other model two and three, I don't solve, okay? This is the idea for the first model. For solving, now I show you the technique of solving, which are, is not connected with the model. It's connected with the mathematics, okay? The technique of solve is, is normalization these two equations, or six, or five, or how many norm equations are. What means normalization? To have plus here. So first one is M1A, T minus I do this operation for how many equations I have. Here I have two. But in final you'll see I'll have six or seven equations. Doesn't matter. I normalize all the equations. That means plus in the front of A. I put line. And I add everything. If I have five equations, I add five equations. If I have two, I add two. Okay? This is M1A plus M2A equal T minus M1G plus M2G minus T. It's clear. T with T. And the acceleration is M2 minus M1 over M1 plus M2G. Okay? This, you see, is the algebraic relation. I have not spoke anything about number till this moment. Why? يعني حالة من خلال المتغيرات لأن ما عوض أي أرقام ولا أي شيء يعني أوجد تسارع دلالة الكتلة الأولى والكتلة الثانية وتسارع الجاذبية الأرضية فقط لأنه حذف الشد في هذه الحالة. You remember what I said. If the acceleration are as we draw, then the total result should be positive. If the total result is positive, look here. M greater than M1. And it's clear if M2 is greater than M1, this is going down, this is going up. Clear. If we were wrong, A is small than zero. So it's clear then M2 is smaller than M1. So M2 is smaller than M1. So M2 is smaller than M1. Now, having the acceleration, I can put the acceleration in any of the other equation and I obtain the tension. Tension equal to M1 M2 over M1 plus M2 G. Yes? What you observe here, who is this? This is the reduced mass. To M reduced G. This is very important. The reduced mass when you are dealing with energy knocking, yes. movement of body without friction. Okay, now 
I finish with the first model I want to clean. لو سمحتي دكتور. تفضل. رمز الكتلة مختزلة؟ مو واضح. اه الكتلة المختزلة طيب ال 2 ايش؟ 2 ام 1 ضرب ام 2 على ام 1 زائد ام 2 رمزها ما هو الان هذا هذا هو هذا هو عندي قال السمبل هذا رمز الكتله المختزله ايوه ام اه ام ريديوس ام ار ار بالضبط ام ار سوري small r but i write here with this is r small r thank you خلاص اللي هو عندك m r بالشكل هذا but small r small r او r صغيره هو كتبها r صغيره okay so i want to clean if you have question No question. Okay. هذا النوع الأول من المسألة. بدو يمسح اللوحة ويحط النوع الثاني من المسألة. The second model of problem contain all the idea of the first model. Plus one. Yes. All the ideas from the first model plus one step. نزيد على خطوة واحدة على المثال الأولاني. Don't be afraid. It's easy. Now, I want to solve it with your help. I want to solve it with your help. Let's try again, together. Which is the first step? Draw the reference frame. I said I take the reference frame Tied to the lab. X I. What is the second step? Drawing forces. Began with weight 